Mark, Texas, a town of just over 2,000 people, where champions are born. People have said that it's something in the water that makes us this, like, this good. A football program that's been elite for nearly 100 years, winning its first official state title back in 1957, and later accumulating the second most in the state with eight. 99, 06, and all the ones we won recently. Under head coach Kevin Hoffman, the Panthers have won three in a row, and on Wednesday, have a chance to join a prestigious group and make it four. The run that we're on right now is, is special. There's only been four teams to do it. We want to rewrite the, uh, the record books, and we want to rewrite the history books. But to be a Panther is more than playing for those on the team. It's playing for a town that revolves around the Friday night lights and for the kids dreaming of one day, too, becoming a champion. Since a kid, everybody have like around the town have wanted to be like wearing the purple and gold on a Friday. And not only did he get to put on a Panther uniform for the last four years, Redrell Freeman has the chance to make history. It's been a dream for me ever since I was a kid. It's really like an honor of getting four rings. The only athlete on the current varsity roster who has played in all three winning state title games. And amidst a global pandemic, nothing has stopped Freeman and his team from keeping their eyes on the prize. These kids don't let anything phase them. They're, they, you know, they're year in and year out and day in and day out and week in and week out. And, you know, they, they just want to play football. And they have one more chance to do just that. Wednesday, 7 p.m., Jerry World, where just the Winthorpe Trojans stand in the way of the Panthers and history. It never gets old. Winning, winning never gets old. Nikki Latarulo, Six Sports.